Well, something as simple as a new shirt or a pair of sneakers can lift a child's spirit. And encourage them to stay in school. Yuki Washington has a story in this week's Story of Brotherly Love. A dusty classroom was converted to a place that can feed and clothe a community. And a teenager was a big part of it. Okay, yeah. Alicia Bridges is combing the racks for the perfect outfit. This is beautiful. But this is not a store. It's not even a thrift shop. It's the community school closet at South Philadelphia High School. Which is a, a classroom renovated inside of this building and it's decorated as a mini retail store. But everything's free. The 17-year-old senior has been instrumental in getting this room ready and filled with donated clothes, food, toiletries, and much more. She even won a Young Heroes Award from the National Liberty Museum. It's a great help to have that inside school and for people in, outside in our community. You know? So it's almost just when they come in here, they're like, oh my God, it's like an actual store. Community like school a, coordinator a, 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 Janelle Harper said it got off the ground when a church donated 40 bags worth of clothing. Then teachers, community members, and students added to it. And it just has come from something that was just coats, hats, and gloves last year to 5,000 things have been given out since then. And it's not just open to students. The community at large can come and shop as well. Every donation helps. One of the biggest needs is sneakers, which can be worn year-round. Some kids wear like the same sneakers for like a whole school year and try to fit into them the next year. Principal Kim Lim Check Taylor says the closet makes children want to come to school. Our students feel like they can come to the closet and not feel ashamed or look upon because they need something to wear. We're all humans and they see that, so they relate off of that. If you want to drop off things like clothes, food, and toiletries, you can contact the school to arrange a drop-off. To find out more about the Community School Closet, go to our website at cbsphilly.com brotherly. I'm Yuki Washington, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.